For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I want to show some more display I.O. stuff. This time, it's going to be positioning. I've got this little pill shape. This is actually a round rectangle. And I've set it up on this OLED feather wing so that I can use the A and C buttons to slide this left and right. Move that around, kind of like a little paddle in Arkanoid or Breakout. And I can also hit the B button to reset it. First of all, we're going to import some libraries, including the display I.O. library, and in this case, the display shapes round rectangle. Then I set up the display and I create this object right here. The round rect is a round rect, and I position it at uh, zero and a particular height, as well as a width and height of the object. I'm deriving those from the display itself, so this is somewhat portable code. And then I'm setting this to have a radius of eight around those corners. I fill it black and put a little white outline on it with a stroke of one. Then as I, in the main loop of the program, adjust buttons, we're simply changing the position. So I have a variable called xpos, and I'm either subtracting from it or adding to it. And then I'm updating the object with this line right here, round rect.x equals xpos. So as that x position changes, so does the position of the round rectangle. The middle button here sets this to be center of the screen. And then the button on the right adds to it. And so that's a really simple way to use the X positioning on an object inside of Display.io to move things around. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec.